This week and next, high school seniors are graduating all across Washoe County, and on average, about 250 students will earn their diplomas at each commencement. But at the smallest school in the district, you can count the number of graduates on one hand. Ryan Kennedy was at Gerlach K-12 this morning and shows us why today's ceremony was historic for the small rural town. One chapter is coming to a close and no one is sure what comes next. Adrian Huzar, Destiny Kazee and Jordan Shell. Those are the names of the three students who make up the entirety of the 2019 graduating class of Gerlach K-12. I really came together really nice. I enjoyed it a lot. It was nerve wracking, but it was it was nice and felt good to see all my family and friends. Even community members and school board trustees filled the school's small auditorium to recognize the accomplishments of these outstanding students. I'm really honored just that so many people came out to support the school and knew that this was so important to everybody. And as she said, today wasn't just a special day for the grads. It was historic for the school itself because the last time there was a graduating senior class in these halls was almost a decade ago. The last time I was on this stage, I was addressing the class of 2011 as the valedictorian. Unfortunately, my graduation ceremony held a sad undertone. Here on the outskirts of Gerlach is the small town of Empire, where many of the residents rely on employment from the mine here. So when it shut down eight years ago, there was a lot of uncertainty about the future of the community and the school. So we were losing a huge part of our population. Um, the school went from about 80 students down to eight, and it was just a lot of conversations with the district that even kept us open at all. But at that time, we couldn't imagine having another class of high school graduates. But when the mine reopened in 2016, the town and the school turned its luck around. And now with its sights on only continuing to grow, Gerlach K-12 anticipates many more and even larger graduating classes in the future. We're back in our local community now and everyone got to come out and um, share this overwhelming feeling of joy with us that we really have something to be proud of. We have our school, it's established, we have our graduates, we're back in a building that was closed off to us for quite some time and it feels good to be home. Covering the story from Gerlach. <laughs> Ryan Canaday, 2 News. Uh, great story and congrats to them. And get this, two of the three seniors also had a sibling and a cousin graduate from kindergarten today there at Gurilac K-12. So fun to watch. Now here's